Something I forgot to mention in this one is that all the gameplay you're going to be seeing right now in this video is from 1.06, the new update. In case you were wondering how it plays, this is all gameplay from the new update. What's going on guys? So just want to make a quick video today talking, reflecting on patch 1.06 for Cyberpunk 2077. We know it came out yesterday. It's a hot fix. Uh, I mean, we, we, dude, we discussed it for a lot because I said it was small, but then again, it came out at like 15 gigs on Xbox and 17 on PlayStation. So it ain't really that small, but then other people were saying, you know what? Most of that isn't really used. So it is small and on PC, it's only like 500 megabytes or whatever. So it's it's just a huge, <laughs> who knows at this point, man, but um, the reason I said it was small is because, yes, it is a hotfix, and uh, the patch notes that we saw, there was only three of them, really. I mean, there was one quest one, the one with Dum Dum, which you guys loved, because apparently a lot of you guys were having that problem, and then uh, the save file issue on console and on PC, uh, which on console, they didn't specifically address the 8 megabyte save file size corruption limit, but on console, they said that it was improved memory management and stability. That's how they put it. Uh, and they also said that the stability results in fewer crashes. So I just want to talk about that today. Now, for me, I didn't put in as much time as I usually do before I give the patch reviews for you guys. I only put in about seven hours. And in those seven hours, I didn't get a single crash, but I haven't crashed since 1.04. Yeah, dude, seriously, I haven't crashed since 1.04. So for me on Xbox One, I haven't crashed as much. But again, I know on PS4, crashing is more of a problem than on Xbox. So you guys are going to have to go look at that, especially you PlayStation players, and let me know, just like you did in the comments on my last one, how much crashing is going. Let's just discuss down there, because I know on PS4, it's a real problem. And even on PS5, I'm seeing a bunch of people having a ton of crashing problems problems but uh, yeah this is a pretty small hotfix all things considered especially considering there's huge ones coming in January and February that is January one dude I'm almost as hyped about that update as I was for the game man it's gonna be huge but uh, let's not underestimate this save file size thing I mean it was stupid of them to put it in to begin with but the fact that they went in and they were listening to the fans and they altered that is a good thing let's not underestimate that okay Next up, we got the money glitch. Now, I showed you guys after 1.05 that the money glitch with the paintings still works, and I gave you guys a tutorial how to do it. Now, they didn't mention anything about the money glitches in the patch notes, but they could always kind of secretly go and patch it without letting us know. Now, I went in and I tried it yesterday, and it still worked for me, okay? But listen, I know a lot of people in the comment section of that video said, hey dude, that's not working for me. I have to buy back the painting for so much money. So what I want you to do is, if you're gonna do this, go and make a save game from before you buy the painting back and, and sell it off and all this stuff so you don't lose a bunch of money, right? Because it's possible that it won't work for you or you did it wrong or something. But I want you to know that it's not gone because I just did it yesterday, which... Uh, Right after I up, up, um, updated my game to 1.06, I went and I tried it. It was one of the first things I did, and it still works. So I want you guys to go in and give it a shot, but make sure you save your game beforehand so you don't lose a ton of money in case it doesn't work. And yeah, guys, along that line, the money glitch with the sodas. You know, remember, you know the soda one where you can dispense like a, a million sodas and stuff like that? I don't like that one. I find it to be really tedious. But I believe that one still works as well, according to the friends I've talked to who went and tried it out. But again, protect yourself. In case it doesn't work for you, make a save game beforehand so you don't blow $8,000 on soda cans or something. You know what I mean? So protect yourselves. But it does work, okay? I mean, they're not going to go in without having some kind of download and remove this thing. So people who are saying, oh, it doesn't work in 1.06. No, it does work. You just probably did it wrong or maybe it doesn't work for you. But uh, we've gone and we've tested it. It does work, the money glitch, with the paintings. Here's the thing, though. You want to go in and you want to do the painting thing as soon as you can because then even if it does get patched, your 600 paintings will carry over from after the patch. So you can still keep selling them off and keep making a bunch of money even after this feature gets patched. So get on it and do it right away. I got a tutorial on my channel. You can go check it out. Uh, and it will help you be a millionaire, a billionaire in cyberpunk. Yeah, guys, we're slowly chipping away every update. Every update slowly chipping away here. 
And I will say this, I haven't noticed any real frame rate improvements in this update. Like in, in 0.05, dude, that was so noticeable. It was night and day from 0.04, how much smoother the game was. In 0.6, I haven't noticed very much of a frame rate change. If anything, it's a tad laggier, like nothing crazy. I'm nitpicking at this point but I haven't really noticed any frame rate changes. Let me know about you guys what you've noticed in that department with the frame rate, okay? And the bugs, virtually similar. Almost the same exact thing. They didn't mention in the patch notes that they've really fixed any bugs other than the quest one. So, I mean, we can't expect them to have fixed bugs in this thing because uh, they didn't really mention it in the patch notes. And it's just a little hot fix. The big one is coming on the horizon. Who knows what's next for them, okay? They could be coming out with a big patch in uh, uh, three days, two days, four days, whatever it is, right after Christmas holiday, they could come out with 0 0.07, you know? I mean, they don't announce it, they just kind of smack it on out of nowhere. So we will see, and maybe the big one will come earlier than January, who knows? But you guys know me, I'm going to be right on it. Within the next couple hours of it being announced, I'll make a video about it with the patch notes, because, uh, yeah, it's working well. And let me know your guys' experience with 0 0.06 in the comments down below. Uh, because, yes, it is small, but at the same time, 15 to 17 gigs, hmm, is there more that meets the eye there? I'm wondering. But let me know in the comments down below. Uh, like this video if you enjoyed it, you want to see more stuff like this, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one, all right? Peace out.